it's your boy, Mr. Flight Academy Kicks, aka Pass the Flight, Shoot Flight, Flex Luger. Call me what you want, but can't play the boy broke. They should I'm be rich in Christ, man. Back with another video as usual. If you have already, make sure you subscribe to the channel. So we rock with the flight crew. You don't have fun. Before we get started, I want to send a message out. I told y'all I'm coming for the early review crown. So make sure you follow me on IG, Flight Academy, underscore kicks with a Z. Your boy, Mr. Flight Academy Kicks, aka Pastor Flight, Sugar Flight, Ghost Candy Man, all them great names. Call me what you want. Can I call your boy broke? Because I am rich and Christ Man back. But yet another video for y'all today, man. And before we get the video started, y'all already know how we do this thing, man. If you have not already, please make sure you subscribe to the channel right now. Hit the subscribe button, man. Make sure you sub up to the channel. And as well as, man, follow me on IG, Flight Academy underscore Kicks with a Z. Follow the store page, Flight Academy Kicks underscore L A L. I just want to say, man, it feels good to be back in front of the camera recording for y'all once again, man. I got to tell y'all, man, this year started off very rough, man. I was very, very sick, man. I don't know if I had the flu, COVID, whatever it was, man, but I was down for the count, man. I was out of commission, man, and, um, you know, I still tried to post on the ground for some of y'all, man, just to make sure, you know, I'm still posting and staying calm, consistent with content, man, but... It was rough, man. Like, you know, I ain't never had the flu like this, man. I don't know what it was, man, but uh, a lot of my family came in town for the holidays, and they got, they were the first ones to get sick. And I was good, man. I was good for a while, and then they finally caught me. But when they caught me, it tore me up, man. So I just feel good about being able to get back to it, man, getting in the store, bringing some content, bringing some early review, man. I did a couple of upgrades. Uh, that's why I was going to drop a video like a few days ago, man, but I kind of upgraded the scenery a little bit, man. Wanted to bring a little bit better content this year because I plan on, I plan on um, hitting 100K this year, man. Listen, we were playing around, man. I only got busy with the store, so it's not as easy to always drop content like that when you're so busy with the store. Like any of y'all that ever have a business or just work in the general and got a life, you know what I'm saying? Y'all understand exactly what I'm saying. Like it gets... Crazy sometimes, man. But listen, this year we're gonna hit 100k, man. And I know for us to hit 100k, I gotta be consistent with the content. And that is what I'm going to do. I ain't gonna deliver that. Man. I'm gonna be consistent with the content, dropping information, let y'all know about drops. Whatever we can, man. I'm going to bring that information to you. But what I need for you to do, man, is make sure you share, like, comment, all those great things, man. Blast it, man. Put when the video drop, put it on your social media, man. Show love, comment. All those great things, man, because this is the year we want to hit 100K. And I don't want to take a long time doing it, man. So let's get straight to it, make sure we knock it out. Because I got some exciting stuff going on this year, man. And I'm thinking about, like, other, I got my other podcast channel that is all set and ready to go. So we're going to be knocking that out, man. So y'all make sure y'all subscribe to that podcast channel, Deep in the Kicks. Um, we're going to be getting on that. We're going to be talking. I got that set up going over there. So listen, y'all be prepared for what's about to happen when it comes to these channels, man. But please, man, I'm gonna need y'all hit the hit 100k. But briefly, man, I want to talk to y'all about what the video's about today, man. Listen, finally, man, finally, 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 I think this is gonna be great. We are getting a new and improved Retro 4, man. Now, some of you know the SB4, which has been considered as the sneaker of the year for last year. It is, um, it dropped last year, but it is the most comfortable Retro 4. I have ever put on my feet, man. Listen, no matter what size ankle you got, whether you got big ankles, small ankles, man, that pull tab on the back, or not even a pull tab because you can't pull it, but more like the um, the, the the addition to the heel badge. Let's say that, man. The addition to the heel badge, man, when that jump roll the back of your feet, man, or the back of your ankle, that's the most aggravating thing. One of the most uncomfortable things of it, man. But I had a conversation with my guy, man. He informed me they're going to redesign the Retro 4 and moving forward, and they're all going to be built like the SB4s, man. So the soft cushioning, um, I think that, that extension of the heel badge being a little bit softer material, not that hard rubber material that cuts into your skin. It is exciting news, man, because Retro 4 is all one of the most popular Jordan silhouettes. But however, it is one of the most aggravating ones, okay? It is one of the most uncomfortable ones. Now, I don't care what nobody say. The most popular Jordan silhouette shoe um, is the Jordan 11. But it is the most uncomfortable shoe to wear for a very long time. Like, extremely long time. Like, I think the max you could get out of the Jordan 11s may be like 
two to three hours, man. After that, boy, your pinky toe just be calling on Jesus, man. Like, it gets crazy. It may be just me, may not. Well, I'm just telling y'all that I know for a fact that Retro 11 will have your foot hurting, bro. It will have your foot hurting, man. And the same with the Retro 4s, man. So, you know what I'm saying? It's like when we picking at the ladies, man. They always want the nice heels and all that. But they have them out and they can't even walk in them. Well, fellas, we the same way with these J's, man. These J's get very uncomfortable, man. So the fact that they're going to redesign the Retro 4 to give us that new feeling, good, comfortable feeling with the Retro 4s, that is going to be amazing. But however, I am going to tell you this, though. That may actually cause a spike in the Retro 4s because on top of everything, we got a lineup dropping this year. Like, it's getting crazy this year with sneakers, okay? So regardless of how you feel, we're into the sneakers, right? This year... Is some heat and some banging. And we'll talk about that in a separate video. I'm not going to mix it up. But this year has some bangers and some sneakers we've been asking for. We're getting them. I'm looking forward to a ton of shoes. This might be the most exciting year of sneaker releases we've had in probably about four or five years. I'm not even going to lie to you. And the crazy part is the sneaker release is not even done. There's still going to be about another 30 pairs that's going to get released that they probably haven't even talked about yet. Because they always... Adding in and dropping a pair in. So be prepared for that, man. But yes, man, the Retro Fours are getting a new sleek design. Um, and like I said, well, not really sleek design, but more like a reforming. Let me know in the comment section right now, man. Listen, if any of you, some of you, not all of you may have the actual SB Retro Fours. So I'm kind of talking a little fast for some of you because you're probably like, well, bro, I don't even know how those Retro Fours fit. Trust me, man. Ask anybody that has those SB Retro Fours. They are comfortable. They are the most comfortable version for. They're so comfortable. I sold my pair. <laughs> I sold my pair twice, man. But y'all know I got a sneaker store, man. And I got celebrity clients. So I be having to, like, you know what I'm saying, fit the need of what they need, bro. So I be selling them. But I'm going to get my pair back, man. And they already need to jump up in price, too. Those virtual MS fours have jumped up in price a ton, man. All because they got labeled a sneak of the year, man. But I couldn't agree with it much more, man. But I am looking forward to seeing what the retro fours are gonna feel like. Now, keep in mind the reimagined fours. Um, I don't know those. I don't know if those will fit like the SB fours. That's gonna be the first tester. So I don't know if they're doing it after that retro four at least. With some of those already produced before they even made the announcement on it. But we're gonna see, man. When I do the early review for y'all on that one, you're gonna see exactly if. That sneaker um, has the the same comfortability as the SB4, which I'm praying for, being that they made it a real madness. So I'm definitely looking forward to that, man. So that is exciting news, man. That, that is exciting news for anybody that's sneakerheads. Like, trust me, that is what y'all want to hear, man. That is what you want to hear, man. So, um, yes, man, we're we, we looking forward to that, man. So let me know what y'all think in the comment section about that information. I know you, there can't be no hate with that, man. Nothing but excitement. We have uh, went through some tough times with these Retro Fours. We have sacrificed the skin on the back of our ankles. We have sacrificed the pinky toe comfortability, okay? This is what we wanted, and this is what we're looking for, man. So make sure you stay tuned and lock in for more news, man. But, yes, like I said, I don't want to talk too much about it, man, but this year it's going to be a great year for sneakers, man. And dare I say, man, uh, the sneaker market actually may start going back up on the rise this year. And that may be good news for some, and it may not be, man. But, you know, it's just one of them things. But we're going to talk about it. We're definitely going to talk about it because I've been studying and seeing some moves of some people lately. And they uh they kind of give me the hint, like, hey, man, something is brewing up, man. You know what I'm saying? The storm is about to kick back up, man. But let me know what you think, man. But listen, we got to get out of here. I got more videos dropping this week, man. I'm going to drop another one tomorrow. Tomorrow is... What is tomorrow? Tomorrow is Saturday. So, yeah, I might drop a video tomorrow, too, man. I got early reviews next week, though. Definitely got some shoes coming in next week. Make sure y'all tune in, man. Listen, I should have been hit 100K, man. Let's keep it a ball. I should have been hit 100K, but I just been busy with the store, and I still am, man. But I am dedicating this year to getting this content to y'all and staying committed, man. Some people, well, a few people have, but the last message that I got in my inbox it kind of pulled on my heartstrings, man. They said, man, bro, since you opened the store, I feel like you forgot about us. And I said, dang, it wasn't that, man. You know what I'm saying? But sometimes when you work so much, people don't understand. They think, I don't know, I don't know if people think we just be sitting around not doing nothing. 
But like, I got a ton of stuff going on. And like I've always told y'all, man, like, sneakers ain't the only channel, not only channel, sneakers is not the only business that I got, man. I got like other stuff. So I would legit just be extremely busy, man. But flight crew, I promise you, man, if you rock with me this year, Gonna rock with you and I'm gonna bring this content to y'all constantly, constantly, constantly. I got the calendar fill up on the topics we're gonna talk about. Y'all know when I drop information, it don't be no BS. I ain't just dropping a video to say I drop a video like it be something y'all can enjoy. I got y'all this year. If y'all got me, man, get me to 100k, man. Until next time, y'all know how we rocking. It's a new year, but it's still the same thing, man. Long little nip, man. Take flight with the flies. If you ain't flying me, just ain't flying right. Hustle and motivate, baby. Long live milk, man. We out.